that won't happen again. Was that compassion on Mr. Shumway's face? Magic was mathematics. What you've just witnessed is learning how to do percentages. Easy and trivial. She looked away. For me at any rate. For you, however. Yes. She looked back at him. Impossible, she said. Unless, of course, you have the aptitude. Has Suslovitz. You'll like his department. It's, um, well, almost normal. Civil engineering, like I said. Can't get more down to earth than that. In the air. But it's still all about planning permission and quantity surveying and snagging lists and subcontractor scheduling. Not much. Ma and here's an excellent example of it in action. Paul frowned. Sorry, he said. I don't follow. She raised an eyebrow. Come with me, she said. Don't worry. See how many nooks they're all staggering around Burzum still. <laughs> I'll pass one in a moment. <laughs> yeah, you don't tend to stagger around the streets. At, no, you, you, you wow. stagger around the pub, stagger into a taxi, bugger off, you know. <laughs> you don't do the hold me back, hold me back dance with your mates as they try and. Oh, no, 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 no. no you don't do that. <laughs> She never gave up trying. Like in Beowulf, yes. Brendel's mum's sister. Giants, goblins, and the Fae, however, are explicitly excluded. On account, she added, with the ghost of a smile, of being officially classified as creatures of darkness. In other words, the enemy. That rules I'm out Mr. Straight of course you are. And what spirit. a cracking bit of driving. And Professor Van Spade yeah. is 462 years old and suffers from chronic asthma. Oh, come on, Paul. Get a grip. I've been visiting you since you were 13. You should know me by now. Go on. Come on, 70 Paul miles an hour in road here, Jake. Trying to get a better look at her face. But she shifted Jesus. a little Slow and the light dazzled him. Sorry, he said, but you aren't at all familiar. <laughs> and I think I'd remember if I'd seen you. He added awkwardly. Yeah, yeah, and round. And then up the street. And then I go in from the bottom. Anyway, he continued, that wasn't weird, 
She goes off to California and next thing I know I'm transferred from general office dog's body to training. Wouldn't blame you if you had. Mel said sympathetically. I mean, it's one thing to hear you talk about it. There must be something else actually having happened to you. For instance, that bloody bike turned up again for one. Luckily, I think I've worked out how to scare it off. Turns out it's allergic to names. Allergic? It's like names is hurt it when it hears them. was a handwritten note from Mr. Tanner saying, Good idea. Thanks. Professor Van Spey himself, no less, summoned Paul to his office and asked him to draft a letter to a client advising on which varieties of garden were most suitable for repelling which categories of